Hi folks, it's the Flying Jogs here again, just watching the beautiful scenic liquid sunshine and we have to go out and play it. Just to show you that, we're in the process of coming into Greenock and um, as you can see, it's got something getting go down there. But it's absolutely liquid sunshine again. Trust us to, to come out and start playing in the wet. But on the plus side, we're going underground today, so going stay tuned. <laughs> now you know why he wants me on so <laughs> Right, so we'll catch you when we get to the underground bit and stay tuned. We're here at Greenock and we're going underground. We're going in a big long tunnel. This is one that's been planning for about six months, but it's that one that's getting brutal by the way. So there's, there's definitely not going to be any drone flying with the day or night. But we're just going to check something out just now, and we'll be back with you in the next uh, scene that you see is you'll see us walking to get access to this tunnel. So we'll see you in a wee bit. Folks, as you can see and behind us, it's the viaduct. Oh, then I get Jamie the frame as well. <laughs> and from the last video that you caught, is that the professor came from there, and we were exploring underneath myself, Jamie, and Connor. Was the buff? Is that there? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Myself and Jamie are going to make our way along. Hopefully, we'll get into the tunnel and we're not going to come across any barriers like, say, the one that's just there behind us, you know. But we managed to get through from another point. Yeah, I'm not going that way just yet. You can figure that one out for yourselves. Right, so at this point, me and Jamie are going to make our way along here, so we're going to be wrong. Going underground! Oh, God. And certainly for me, for this video again. Going and. Uh, Right, so we're going to walk along here before Jamie kills his wee singing. <laughs> and I'm going to B-roll this. And I'm going to put all the scenic stuff and slow motion stuff. And I'm going to put a soundtrack on it's going to end today with Jamie singing underground. <laughs> hey, we'll see you in a little bit once we get to the tunnel. As you can see over the top of this railway here, there's actually a, a stream that comes down from the Greenock Cut and it crosses over here. And it's leaking a little bit. There's also a valve up there if you can see it. To be through to the railway line, there it is. There's obviously a station because there's a platform here. Certainly an embankment, but it definitely looks like a platform. There's two lines that came through here. Sign on the side, possibly serve the sugar factory. And there was another sign in the way up there that we noticed that could have came off and went somewhere else. I'm not sure where that one went. 
Yep, so quite a large platform there. Very substantial. of the tunnels, it's just a short one and it's basically just a bridge over the main road so another spur line the folks were made into the first little bridge tunnel but you can see the still markings here are pretty still new so it shows you when the line revamped this number one there was a 61 that I'll show you the picture of now beside Jamie and now we're coming up to two, you can still see the tag bits of the telephone. Jamie's walking in the middle of the track just now. And there's a marker post. And that's some I don't know what the marker post for, but that's what it's for. Something in to do with the trains. So we'll move on. Continuing along the line, approaching the tunnel. Let's hope there's no barrier on it. It would be nice to get in there. Well folks, I've not got the full light suit just now, but Jamie's there just now, as you can see. We're actually in one of the bigger tunnels. Well, I think this is the longest one we've been on this line, isn't it? Yeah, but you can see, there's wee inlets here, for the, obviously when the trains were coming through. I'm going to hide. I don't went in too deep, because there's uh, the entrance there. So myself and Jamie are going to start walking along here, because there's a bigger tunnel along here and we'll probably break out the bigger lights in a minute or two. Right folks, we'll bring out the big lights. This time, just to show you, I'm going to bring out mine. There's mine here. One of the big ones has got the head torches on. So everything should be pretty much lit up. For what me and Jamie are going to be doing today. I don't know if you can see it, but it's almost like a mist. It's inside this tunnel. You can see the architecture and yeah, the bones all brick stuff, like the greeny, stuck, yucky stuff that's came down through the years as well. See, Jamie's not hanging around, he's on ahead as you can see in the tunnel. Basically, a little laugh on the robot, the two is. You can actually see the water that's come falling in. I'm coming along here. So we're just going to carry along and see what else is at the end of this tunnel. Got a drain something there, I'm right above us. I just noticed that in the light. Don't particularly want to walk in that. As you can see, all the reflector stuff is still there. Nine, I don't know if that's meters, nine meters, yards. Jamie's found something. What on earth is that? 
Switch gear, yeah, or signal. signal Seven for signal. signal. Ah, there's the. See up there? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Some type of gear, a telephone thing. Yeah. No pulleys for the signaling box, wherever that would have been. Along here. Right, so let's carry on. So we're coming out at the end of the tunnel now. Right? This is not the big one, there's a bigger one apparently further along, but on this line, this is one of the biggest. We've yet to see if we can get into the other one. Hopefully we will. I don't know the name of this tunnel, but what I will do is I'll put a link, not a link, I'll put a description underneath it. What I'm talking about now, if I get the name of it, so you see the name of the tunnel. So we're just going to carry along and see what else we come across in this line. You see, Jamie's reflector strips are really working. <laughs> yeah, that's just coming up to the end of the tunnel. Yeah, we'll give you a shout in a minute. Folks, that's just come to the end of the tunnel, and Jamie's just going around the outside, as you can see. So that was quite a long bit of the tunnel there. We'll get some more shots of this on the way back, getting out the big camera, see what type of shots we can get with it. But that's one section, of one of the big tunnels, so we're through one section. Don't know where we are, technically, until you get outside here. I'm going to go and have a look at my... First tunnel, it was quite substantial, a few hundred metres long, and we're heading up towards the next one, which is just a shorter tunnel, but hopefully there's a bigger one up ahead. We're along here, so we're going to be wrong. Going underground! Oh,